I just nearly spilt my pumpkin spice latte all over the car and myself. <laughs> It's real. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well on this Wednesday morning. Is it Wednesday today? Yes, it is Wednesday today. So today, guys, as you probably guessed, we're going to be vlogging because today's video is going to be like a uh, get ready with me for Halloween slash shop with me, decorate with me, like Halloween vibes, basically fall vibes. It's finally that time of year. First things first, obviously, guys, we need to head to the store and I need to buy myself some Halloween decorations. It's a must. So I will see you guys when we're at the store. So we found our first lot of Halloween stuff and this is actually gorgeous. Look how cute these are. I think they're China. So there's this orange one, black and white, and then white on black. And I actually think I prefer this one. And then these are cute little skull plants. I thought you put a candle in there, but they're not. They're literally just like biscuit jars. That's cute. What's this one? For like leaves in it or anything really, couldn't you? Yeah. Anything like autumnal. I think I'll definitely go over this for like a centerpiece on the table. Yay! Oh, this little bit of Halloween autumn decor. Here we go. We found loads of stuff. They have glitter ones. Oh, they're actually really like, they're like sponge almost. Ooh, guys. Oh my gosh, they have mystery Halloween light up bath bombs and hello scream fidget bath bombs yeah we'll get some of these definitely pumpkin string lights oh my gosh i should get one of those yeah <laughs> enter it yeah that's so cute can i keep that up all year round three pounds oh hang on they have they have orange, orange. breaking things oh, trick or treat no. oh i don't know now i think maybe the purple one then yeah gonna go with this one and they have a pink. Oh, I need that. Oh, as a cat on. Oh, look at these. That's the biggest plate I've ever seen in my life. Happy haunting. I could have my food here, and then Dobby could have his food there, and Snoopy there. So they have this as well. This is like literally one pound in black, purple, or orange, but I'm gonna go with black. I think it looks more realistic as like a giant web. Oh my gosh, <laughs> you managed to get them all off. Right, thank you. Here we go, yay. And then I'll get one of the light up bath bombs and one of the squishy bath bombs. Trying the new drink. Oh, they look nice. Thank you very much. So I got some Halloween slash fall slash like autumnal drinks to try. So I got a large pumpkin spiced latte. So I got a large iced pumpkin spice latte. Okay, so let's try this one first. I'm like 99.9% sure I'm gonna like this one. There's a lot of pumpkin in that pumpkin latte. <laughs> that, is. that is strong, okay, right. Very pumpkin-y. 8.5. Oh my God, I thought you were gonna hate that. Right, and then we got two others. Look at that! It literally just looks like Coca-Cola mixed with Sunny D. So this is the pumpkin cream cold brew and this is new out this year so I've been excited to try this one but I feel like it's going to be really strong. Oh, that looks so pretty though. Okay, right, I've it in there. Oh my god! Gee, that is strong! No. Last one! Uh, oh my gosh, this is one I was so excited about. It's an iced blonde salted maple and caramel latte. This is brand new out this year. Oh like a candy apple. Really that sweet. Oh, that's so cute. You've got to try that. Okay. Really? It just tastes really sweet. That's my favourite. I'll give it 9.1. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I've officially, finally, tried three of the four Halloween drinks. I will probably catch up with you guys now, either tomorrow or in a few days' time, when we're going to be doing some more things to prepare for Halloween. 
Okay, my lovely. So it's the next day now. Um, I think I got like majority of what I needed yesterday, but I have just thought of this one shop. It's like a Halloween themed store. So I'm just gonna quickly pop in, see if we find anything. And then I think me and my mum are gonna go and get our nails done, but we're gonna get them like Halloween themed. So I'll go in the store first and then I'll be back with you guys. Welcome in the second Halloween store now, and I've just found this. This gigantic skeleton literally it's nearly as tall as me and you can like hang it so i was thinking maybe i could hang it on the back of my kitchen door so we're gonna get one of these <laughs> these are pretty cool as well these are like i think they're like foam and they have green or purple i don't think they have orange Ugh. rat or is it rat circus, circus popcorn, popcorn. <gasps> Oh, the fact that the tail is hanging out of the back. I'm trying to find a gravestone that isn't broke. Oh, yeah. They, they just come in damaged. They all, like, broke there. That'll do. So I have one of these from last year, so I don't need one of those. And then this is, like, face paint, really, isn't it? Guys, they have Halloween bucket hats. I like this one. How cool is that? It's a good fit. Does it look nice? Yeah. <laughs> I actually quite like that. Or the ghost one. Oh yeah, it's just black and white. Yeah, I like that one. Comment down below which one you'd buy. The purple and orange or the black and white. Okay, so I managed to find a few things in the shop. I literally just got a hat, the giant skeleton, and the little tombstone. So before I head home now to start decorating, I'm going to go and have my nails done. So this is what my nails look like currently. I have this baby blue colour and then this silver, but they're really grown out. And this is what mom has. She has like this lime green colour and then also a silver. So I think we're going to get Halloween colours. Do you know what colour yet? No. 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 Something bright or Halloween-y, something spooky. Let's head to the nail salon. Now. So this is the colour that mum got, this Halloween purple and a gold sparkle. And this is the colour I got, which is a lot brighter than I thought it would be. This bright green and a black glitter. I am super happy with how they turned out though. And I feel like these will be perfect now for like the Halloween challenges I'm going to be doing and the Halloween unboxings. Like you guys better be ready. So I'm going to head to my house now and take all the decorations with me and we're going to start decorating. Hello. Oh my gosh. So it is a lot later on now and I'm finally finally at my house i had to film some brand deals my hair is curly i think it was probably straight earlier this morning but i'm finally here guys and i've laid out all my halloween stuff and honestly we have so much more than i thought we were gonna have like now i'm looking at it i'm thinking we bought too much but let me show you this is all the stuff that we've bought and honestly guys i didn't think we bought that much so i think it's time guys to finally start Decorating. So I think I'm gonna focus on the kitchen first, like making this area quite spooky. Okie dokie guys, I think I have finished decorating. There's like a few things that I've bought that I don't know what to do with. So I'm gonna show you guys them now and ask you because I think that you guys would have a better idea than me. Okay, so first off, I put the giant skeleton on the back of the toilet door, just because the toilet door already has a nail on it. Um, but I don't know whether to put this on the back of the kitchen door. And then the rest of it, I literally did put in the kitchen. So this is the table now, definitely more spooky looking. And obviously I'm going to be doing a lot of my Halloween unboxing videos on this table. So I needed this to really fit the theme, if that makes sense. And then I just put this china pumpkin as the centerpiece and these little ones around it. Then I put this guy over here on my second fridge just with the bucket and another little pumpkin. I never use this fridge so it's fine right now. Then obviously I put the doormat by my door. Then around by here I put these by the sink. So just this pumpkin pie candle, another two pumpkins and my little skull plant. Then I put the tombstone and another two pumpkins. Honestly I have so many pumpkins guys just by the sugar and the tea bags. And then I still have these things that I'm not sure what to do with obviously i'm gonna be wearing this so that's fine but i'm i bought this because it looked pretty but now i don't know where to put it and then this i feel like this is really cool but like where do i put it you know what i mean and then i could hang this up maybe i should hang this 
on the back of the door, maybe by there. Yeah, let me know, help me out, because I'm really not sure what to do with those three things. But my kitchen definitely fits the vibe more now for all the Halloween videos that are gonna be coming out. Like I said, I'm not that big on Halloween decorating. Like for Christmas, I would do my whole house. But for Halloween, I feel like I just wanna do like one or two rooms. Okay, so now I'm gonna get all of the mystery stuff that we have to unbox out and just organize this so you can see what's coming up. Okay guys, so we have our 13 day spooky advent calendar. Our nightmare before Christmas adorables. Literally already forgot that I bought these. Our fidget Halloween bath bomb and our light up spooky Halloween bath bomb. Our mystery Disney villain Funko Pops. And our mystery Scooby Doo Halloween blind bags. Our mystery Hocus Pocus blind bags. And our Boo Hollow capsules. And then I have this, which is a pumpkin outfit for my little puppy Dobby because I've decided for his first Halloween, he's gonna be a pumpkin and I hope he likes it. Oh my gosh, that is everything we have, guys, ready for all our Halloween videos. And also, sneak peek for my next video. If you've watched this far, I am going to be going hunting in vending machines for fidget. So I think that's gonna be quite Halloween themed as well. So I really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Getting ready for Halloween with me, coming shopping with me, getting our nails done, decorating, and obviously organizing all of our mystery stuff ready for this crazy month of October. If you're excited for all of this stuff coming up and for Halloween, give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what your favorite part of this vlog was. I can't wait to chat with you guys in the comments. So thank you for watching. Have the best day ever. Keep shining and I'll see you in my next video tomorrow. Bye guys. I love you. Mwah.